hello everyone and welcome back to my youtube channel so guys today in this video i'm gonna tell you how to fix airdrop not working issue on iphone 15 15 pro and 15 pro max so guys many iphone 15 users are complaining about that their air airdrop is not working properly and they don't know how to fix this so guys don't worry in this video i'm gonna tell you how to fix this issue first of all you have to do is check capability Insecure that the device you are trying to airdrop with a capable with your device with your iPhone model. What devices need to support airdrop for it to work? After this, then you have to do is turn uh, turn airdrop off and on. Go to your control center. Not go here, and you can see your option airdrop. Simply tap on it, then enable it, then disable it again. And you have to also make sure that your Wi-Fi and Bluetooth are also enabled. After this then you have to do is check your aeroplane mode and do not disturb mode. Insecure that aeroplane mode and do not disturb mode are turned off. These settings can interfere with your airdrop. So you have to make sure that aeroplane mode and do not disturb modes are disabled. After this and you are still facing the issue then you have to do is restart your iPhone. A simple restart can often resolve minor software glitches. Turn off your iPhone by going to your settings. Tap on general. Scroll down then tap on shutdown. Shut down your iPhone and then restart it after 15 to 20 seconds later. After restarting your iPhone, then you have to do is check for iOS update. Make sure your iPhone 15 is running the latest version of iOS. Outdated software can cause issues, so you have to go to your software update and check if there is any available update for your iPhone. If there is, then simply update your iPhone to the latest version of iOS. After trying this all solution, you are still facing the issue again and again, then you have to do is reset your all settings. You can try resetting all settings on your iPhone. This will revert all settings to their default, but it won't erase your data. To do this, you have to go to your general, scroll down, then tap on transfer reset iPhone, tap on reset, tap on reset all settings, enter your passcode and fix your issue. So guys, if this video helps you, then make sure to like and subscribe my YouTube channel for upcoming videos and thanks for watching.